<laughs> the moment you have all been wishing for. Spoken Word Sunday, episode 11. Ashi. Episode 11, live poetry. Hello everyone, this is Devan Edwards, aka Devan the Connector, connecting you to the knowledge that will empower yourself. And today is going to be a powerful spoken word Sunday. Some might even say prophetic. Some might say that. And I'll tell you why. Because <laughs> I wrote I wrote this poem. This poem is um very dear to me. I wrote this about three, near, almost three years ago. Around 2017, 2018. And the topic... <laughs> the topic is 5G Yes, 5G I knew about this about 3 years ago And I think now is the perfect time to speak on it Because it's happening right now This year, 2020, new decade But many, many people that I know Have known about this for years And we've been preparing, prepare, uh, we've been preparing for it um and yeah the literally the theme of this year is don't be scared be prepared and i must say i'm gonna it's gonna be a it's gonna be somewhat of a king's speech so i gotta drink the king of coffee if you don't know you don't know then reach out to me and um we can talk some more and connect but what So yeah, the poem I'm going to read, um, I titled this poem, The 5G That I See. The 5G That I See. And um, before I read this, um, even some reference points you can probably go look at after this is, check out the World Economic Forum on YouTube. They literally did a video introducing um, 5G innovation and whatnot. Cause, and even if you see the networks now... 5G is going to become a norm. So it's like, we need to understand that it's going to become a part of our daily life. And um, we need to just prepare for that. We need to prepare. And, again, seek ways in which you can prepare for that. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, I'm not I'm not waiting for any more people to come in. We are going to get into this. And you can watch this afterwards. So, this is called the 5G that I see. Five G operating in this new generation, bringing new speeds on this timeline to help you navigate more efficiently in your reality and feel fine. Woo. Yet still, with this new generation, there's an unexplained sensation. High frequencies and bandwidth with gigahertz you couldn't even handle. Overstimulation of our nerves puts us in an unnerving state. Eager to check the phones to make you feel great. But is that so great? Did you know that 5G is a carcinogen? Yes. It's killing them. Killing you. So you lose if you choose. How it affects you is up to you. If you choose not to harm yourself. Pick up those crystal grids, shungai and EMF protectors in all forms to arm yourself. And, dis and disarm the charms the media projects to bring suicide alarms to your health. Stay vigilant. Stay woke. Stay neutral to identify truth from joke. Woo! So many things. Many bells of many rings. Like 5G causing cancer? Oh, now you're questioning. Question how 5G has a hundred times more EFMF waves than 4G. So you can see and wait to feel the weight of what the war on your body will see. Then maybe, then maybe you'll seek the answer. 5G nets working until 2025. Virtual reality coming through to digitize how you come alive. 
priming your soul for body mind control. But will you stay alive with what you know? Knowing of the 5G that I see? A 5G that demands protection from its possession. Platinum to support and repair your, your DNA from going in disarray. And right now you can win within your space. Unaffected, without trace. Thanks to the grace that the trace mineral of gold can offer you. Ingest it, wear it and own it. Automatically absorb and dispel the radiation on all levels and create the electromagnetic field of protection around you. And the additional benefits of all-going energy will astound you. Solutions are available and now you can have a profound view for both you and for me. Yet will you choose to stay alive and thrive through the 5G for I see? Thank you. That is the 5G that I see. Coming soon to a special poetry book near you. It's coming soon, guys. It's coming soon. It's coming soon. And this is it. this is one of the exclusives that I'm re releasing from that from that poetry book. So, but I just felt it's time to re to read this. You know. Um, I hope this goes viral. I really do, and it will. But <laughs> I hope you liked it. Um, let me know in the comments what you liked best about this this poem. And I hope you got some insight. And if you need any more information, like I'm on my YouTube channel, I've got to put some links to understand more about the the mind but the mind and the evidence behind my poem as well so i want to thank everyone for tuning into this spoken word sunday stay amazing and most importantly stay empowered take care next week 4 p.m bst be there spoken word sunday take care <laughs>